mind reading part of the show. Please put out the information, Smith, and hold them. Thank you. <laughs> he has been named Entertainer of the Year six times by National Association of Campus Activities. Named Entertainer of the Year and the Year four times by Campus Acti Activities Magazine. CNN headlines, news calling him King of College Entertainment. He has made over 40 national television appearances, ranging from Jay Little to Larry King Live. He is an author of three books, including the best seller, Ignite Your Intuition, and he is here to play with our minds. Would you please welcome Craig Carter? Participation. So, who wants to come up here? Yeah. That guy, round of applause, this man in the white hat. Yeah. How you doing, Randy? Man, no, What's no. your first name? Houston, come on over here. Houston, you're gonna find for me in a second. No, just for something else. You see, you see that book on the table? I want you to pick it up, Houston. Look through it. Make sure you use that it is a book. You know, different words on different pages. It is not the same page, repeated page, every page, every page. It is not blank pages, and all the pages run in numerical order. Does it look good? Yes, it looks great. <laughs> that book will run anywhere you see. Now, on average, in this particular book, on a full page of text like this page, or almost this page, there are roughly 300 words of text per page. Now, Houston, I would not expect you to count those, but looking at that, does that look realistic? Yes. Go to the back of the book, you can tell the audience how many pages are actually in the book. What is the last number of pages? 280. 280. So, roughly 300 pages in the book, and roughly 300 words of text on each page. So that gives us a rough total of? A lot. A lot of words, right? Okay, now Houston, I want to turn it back to you. You open a book to any page at all that you want, Houston. Just open it up somewhere. Let, get it? Okay. Now Houston, you should be looking at two pages now. Left hand page and the right hand page. So there should be about 600 words in front of your eyes right now. Are you happy at this point, Houston, or do you want to go to a different point? Oh, I'm happy. You're happy? Okay, good. Houston, let your eyes go down the left hand page, and then let your eyes go down the right hand page. Like you're scanning the pages, you're looking for something. And as you do that, Houston, I want you to choose one word. The only thing that I ask you to do is pick a long word. Get a word that has a lot of letters in it. You don't have to get the longest word or the most interesting word. You only need to get one word, but I want to work some meat to it, a lot of letters to it. Give me a chance to make a mistake or two. Got one already? Memorize the word, Houston, close up the book, set it back down the table. Now, Houston, in a second, I'll count to three. When I read three, all you have to do is think of the first letter of the word you selected. So I'll count to three, and then you think first letter only. Are you ready, Houston? One, two, three. Just think, Houston. Houston has a very interesting mind. Yes. That's a lot of stuff in there. Houston, I've written one letter on the back of this board. What was the first letter of your work? J. What? J. Really? It's exactly what I wrote. I used to do a second. <laughs> no, they're laughing because they don't understand and it scares them. So, instead of showing the fear of that, it's very calm. It's <laughs> When you thought of the letter J, did you visualize the letter J or were you saying J, J, J to yourself? Visualizing or verbalizing, do you remember? Uh, repetition. J, 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 J. Yeah. So not that I have a problem with this almost immediately popped in my mind, see? But this time I read three, I want you to visualize. I just want you to see, don't say it, to see the letter. See like on the back of this board, second letter. Let me go for the second letter. Right here. One, two, three, to see it. Are you seeing it? This is never going to work. Okay. I don't know, Houston, I did the second letter, what was your second letter? A. Now, Houston, I'm going to count three again. This time I read three, you're going to do the same thing, except you're going to see the entire word across the back of this board. Just like you saw when you saw it on the page for the first time, and you thought that's it. It's the same thing. One, two, three, to see it. Forget about her. <laughs> Houston, roughly 90,000 words in that book. You opened it up at one point, and you looked at about 600 words. Now from those 600 words, you just chose a word. Now you didn't write the word down, you didn't point it out, didn't show it to anybody. In fact, Houston, if someone was looking over your shoulder at the page that you were on, 
They would not even know what word you selected, would they? Just in your head. You said, I've written one word on the back of this board. Honestly, what was the one word you made in mind? Jackhammer. 